hey back again to my new video guys this is sampati watching zambas samfx youtube channel and this as you can see poco x3 device and this is the latest version of mio mx rom let me go into the settings and show you as you can see there is a mio mx by mmx team 12.5.4 stable version for poco x3 and you can read here different things as you can see it's still with android 11 only and the security patch is november latest security patch and the kernel used here is 4.14.180 perf kernel see in recent times i have made like miui mint version and miui hellas i already explained many features and everything in the miui roms i will be going to brief little bit only in this video and what all the differences you face among those roms those things i will be explaining out if you are still not watched those videos i will give the cards here one is miui hellas based on 12.5.4 the other one miui mint which is the great thing i can say for miui roms you can check out that video just yesterday or day before yesterday i have posted that later let's see the dialer first here as you can see direct video call feature is available let me see whether the call recording obviously it is there as you can see and other person will never notice that you are recording the call those features are given in this rom and let's see the speed test in this room as you can see i have here like 100 mbps plan it's pulling up to 90 to 95 which is not a problem even with mobile data also i will show you switching between apps and this is a quick settings panel you get as you can see if you swipe from here for example if you swipe from here you will go to notifications if you swipe like this you will get this new control center or whatever you call quick settings or anything like that now let me run with mobile internet connection as you can see the carrier aggregation is also working fine in this room which is not a problem but network strength in my area is very less it's not about rom it's about network area depends upon you as you can see it's pulling something that's how the mobile internet also it's no problem in the even while calling or anything like that let me show you the benchmark results in this is a rom there's a mu mx 12.5.4 based on android 11 with number security patch and single score is 555 and the multi score is 1635 the kernel used here is linux 4.14.180 puff kernel and there's a kernel as recognized, recognized as kernel but you can use it for surya also this rom it's fine the let me show you the display settings also here you get 120 hertz refresh rate i have kept for the same and performance is fine but not great like mui mint version what i have shown previously that was having very good performance even the geekbench scores also very good you will get this magix manager here and i will be posting some of the magix models video tomorrow or within this week some people requested in my channel so you'll be getting that video also and if you're first time to this channel hit down subscribe and also allow the bell notification by pressing the bell icon and if you like the video give it a like guys and let's move into the camera application you get obviously anx or mui camera and you get this dynamic shots and into more there are log mode as you can see nothing new but definitely every feature is working fine in this rom i will disable the download as of now and we'll see the drm info what you will get in this rom you will get level 1 certification such that you can watch hg content in ott applications which is not a problem in this rom let's see the safety net status also let's run this obviously you will get failed here once again let's run this okay you need to pass the safety net status in the rom by disabling the magics or also you can flash the file those things will be working when there's how the mio mix version as you can see there's the latest version you get 12.5.40 we'll go into a little bit of options let's see settings and in additional settings that memory extension is added as you can see extra 2 gb you can enable or disable from here to increase the ram management it won't make much of a difference but definitely going to make some difference and in special features all the basic things are given like floating windows and video toolbox and even the game turbo let me show you i have added the bgm here 
as you can see in the additional settings select the game and you can change the enhanced visuals from virginal moderate strong and extreme based upon that it will change and even the touch resistant area also you can change here and sensitivity to continuous steps and touch response those things you can manually adjust and enhanced experience you can turn off or enable the auto brightness reading mode restrict the screenshot gestures and even you can restrict the notifications shared such that the game experience is going to be better in this ROM better there are options are given but the performance is not up to the level of what I have previously spoken that is the mint version the latest 12.5.4 but there we are having the in display settings let me go always on display option was there in that ROM here we simply don't get that option but here we will get the live wallpapers let me show you as you can see these are the super wallpapers you get from here you can enable let me show you one of them I already applied a one let me show you the dark mode this is how the theme the super wallpaper also get changed let me enable as you can see if you unlock like this you will get this like a cool animation and everything is working fine in this room as you can see this is how the recent tabs you get you also see the how much RAM is available and the extended RAM will not be added here but definitely it's going to help in the RAM management and this is how the dark mode works let me switch to light mode and there are basic options are given like battery saver and all the options are given in the quick settings panel if want you can toggle them between here also notification and control center as you can see you can choose between old and new that's not a problem here main thing is the performance difference what i noticed between this and miwa mint and even the miwa hellas was little bit better compared to this rom and miwa mint is going to be definitely much better to both of these roms what i spoken right now so you can definitely try out the miwa mint version you can skip this if you want live wallpapers then you can use this one i don't think so people who like only live wallpapers are available let's see do comment down in the comment section below and we'll see the sound settings whether we get any settings or anything like that as you can see in the additional settings you get this preset dolby atmos like settings but no dolby atmos if you want that you can check out my one of the videos like experience or like that in that you will get dolby atmos pre-installed in this rom you can even make it out by using magix models which is not a problem and that's all guys in this video let's see the pgm and wind it off this video and you get like settings like smooth plus ultra if you want you can use gfx tool to increase to 60 fps as of now it's just 40 fps definitely it's not that much great compared to miui mint version and even hellas was also a little bit better in performance but this is not bad even and the volume you can see here it's not loud like miui mint version and even let me show you the brightness also it's also not that much great that's what i have noticed these are the little bit bugs will be there definitely in the miui but you can overcome that Okay, I'll come back and let me show you the battery settings you get. As you can see, you get battery saver, ultra battery saver also. 
and let's see the performance of it as you can see one hour 17 minutes when it was like 80 to 85 percent as you can see the chart the idle battery drain is nil here which is good thing the battery life going to be better in this room and that's all guys in this video this is me a mix 12.5.4 on this poco x and i forget to mention this fingerprint unlock as you can see it's not quickest but quick enough to unlock and also show you the face unlock as you can see it's also quick that's all guys in this video this is the MIUI Mix 12.5.4 on this POCO X3 and thank you for watching guys we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keeps smelling bye bye for now